It's fair to say that online marketing is getting harder and harder, especially when it comes to search engine optimization. SEO results have become very crowded, making it difficult for any business to stand out. Between the increasing number of ads, direct answers, maps, and many other snippets, how do you get noticed, right? But when there's a will, there's a way. And in today's video, I'm going to show you a simple technique that will double up the size of your Google listings, which will make your business pop out in this crowded space. The result, you'll drive more clicks to your site, squeeze your competitors out, and it will also prepare your business for the next marketing onslaught, also known as voice search. So stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Luke Duran, the founder of RankingAcademy.co.uk, where I talk about the best tools, tips, and ways to promote your local business online, step-by-step step and click-by-click. Click. On my channel, I cover everything any local business owner needs to know from search engine optimization to social media. My goal is to help you thrive online so you can drive more visitors to your business and ultimately make more money. If you're new here, consider subscribing and clicking on the bell button so you don't miss any of my new videos. One last thing, don't forget to check out the description below, which is where I put additional notes and links I refer to in this tutorial. As the internet is continuously evolving and maturing, we are slowly moving away from conducting our searches in Google from a string of keywords such as cheap tickets, rodeo, Houston, to a more natural language in the form of a question such as how much are tickets to the Houston rodeo? In their quest to remain the number one search engine on the planet and to keep users on their site, Google has multiplied the number of results which include direct answers to those questions in multiple formats using featured snippets like this one, as well as a box called People Also Ask. But at the same time, Google has also given website owners the ability to enhance and expand their Google listing results with special features. Obviously, this is not new. You may have already come across results which display star ratings, for example. But now, you can also integrate frequently asked question listings, which literally doubles up the size of your results. Look at this example for one of my clients who is an electrician and wanted to rank for the keyword storage heater repair. His result went from this to this. Let me show you how it's done. Step number one, identify the right content page. For this to work, you need to identify a page from your website that ranks quite high in Google search engine results. It will not work with your homepage. If you don't know how, go to ubersuggest.com. Type your domain name in the search box, then press enter. Let's use my electrician client as an example. On the left hand side menu, click on the top pages option. The top page is likely to be your home page, so ignore it. The pages below that with the most estimated traffic are likely to be the best candidates. Click on the view all drop down next to the page which will show what keywords this page is ranking for. If the page ranks for keywords that are positioned between 1 and 10, then you are good to go. Step number two add relevant frequently asked questions to the content of the page. Once you've identified which content page is most appropriate, just add a list of FAQs to it. This is the perfect opportunity to enhance your page with more relevant keywords and to answer some of the most common questions users may ask. If you can't think of any specific question to add, go to answerthepublic.com. Type your keyword in a search box and click on the got a question button. This will give you a list of the most popular questions people ask about this topic. To make it easier, click on the data option above the graph. The other alternative is to use Google. Search for your keyword and check the results. Scroll down and find out if there is a people also ask for snippet result. There will be the most popular questions people ask in relation with this keyword. You can expand the box by clicking on the bottom question for more results. Use these results as inspiration. Don't copy and paste. Once you've got your list, just add it to your content pages like this or even this. It doesn't really matter. Step number three, add structured data to your page. Don't panic, this is easy. Structured data is scored in a specific format written in such a way that makes it easy for search engines to understand content. 
Search engines read the code and use it to display search results in a specific and much richer way, like our FAQ. The integration of this piece of code on your website is very easy. Head over to technicalseo.com slash tools slash schema markup generator. From the drop down, select the FAQ option. You should see a form with two fields. One is called question and the other is called answer. Just copy and paste your questions and answer from your content page using these fields. To add a question, simply click on the add question button. You should see the code being automatically created on the right hand side of your window. Once you're done, click on the G icon located right above the code. Select the option Rich Result Test. This will open a Google testing page with the code you've just created automatically copied in a small window. From there, you can verify if the code you've created is valid. Click on Test Code and your code will be analyzed. You should now see a detected item called FAQs with a green tick next to it confirming your code is good. Go back to the Schema Markup Generator tool and this time click on the blue copy icon. This should copy the code to your clipboard. Time to move on to step four. Step number four, integrate the code to your page. All you need to do now is to copy and paste the structured data in the HTML code of your page, more specifically in what is called the head of the page. I can't cover all scenarios here because it would take too long, but if you are using WordPress, here is how to do it. Download and install a plugin called Header and Footer Script. Locate the page where you've added your FAQs and click on Edit. Scroll down until you see a box called Insert Script to Head. Paste your script in there and save your page. Every content management system will be different, so if you are unsure how to add code to the head of the page, just refer to your provider. And now for the last step. Step number five, tell Google the page has been updated. This is optional, but it will speed up the process. For this step, you need to have a Google Search Console profile installed. If you haven't, do it today. It's essential to have if you're serious about your online business and it's free. For those of you who do, log into your Google Search Console profile. Copy the web address on which you have added your FAQs content and the code and paste it in the Inspect Any URL box field, then hit the Return key. You should see a box with the option Request Indexing. Click on the link. This will submit a request to Google for the page to be crawled. Make sure you do this only once and then you're done. That's all I have for you today. Repeat this process for all your content pages and you will double the size of your presence in Google search results almost overnight. I did this on multiple pages for one of my clients and some of his listings were updated within 24 hours. The others only took another couple of days. This is a simple technique with huge benefits, one of which being your website content showing in the answer snippets of Google, which is used for voice search results, preparing your business for the next generation of search voice. So don't miss out and start today. If you like this video, please give me a little thumbs up. Otherwise, I'll see you for another tutorial very soon. Happy marketing.